I'm Professor Robert Murphy from Northwestern University in Chicago. Uh, we are finishing our fourth annual meeting of our research training grant. Uh, and uh, I gave a presentation uh, this morning on uh, grant writing uh, with Professor Hall. Uh, and we discussed many aspects of writing grants, what grants uh, were eligible to apply for, and uh, how to prepare uh, an NIH biosketch. Well, uh, yes, for the last three days, we've actually been reviewing the progress uh, of the uh, research training grant here, which focuses on HIV and mycobacterial disease. Uh, we've hit all of our milestones uh, regarding this grant. We've trained multiple uh, master's degree uh, students in public health, bioinformatics, and biology. Uh, we have four PhD candidates that we've supported uh, during this grant. We've uh, supported five faculty mem members who have come to Chicago for faculty enrichment uh, experiences. Uh, and we've awarded uh, seed awards uh, related to early projects uh, that many of the trainees uh, have proposed and we've funded. Well, the advice is that we need to continue. Uh, we need to continue with the training and apply for grants. Uh, and our goal is really to help the Malian scientists become independent and have sustainable careers and be able to attract external funding from the university for their very important research work. This was the first five-year cycle of this HIV and mycobacterial disease uh, research training grant. We plan on applying for a renewal of this grant for another five years. That renewal will go in next summer uh, in 2020. Uh, we should hear about the results of that renewal uh, in the fall or early winter, uh, and uh, we hope that the grant will then continue uh, after the uh, planned exp expiration date for this phase of the, of the grant.